As a group, motorcycle riders aren't big on convention. So when it comes to the look of their ride, they often go their own way. The gas tank presents the greatest opportunity when customizing the facade of the bike. Prominent and upfront, the tank both fuels the ride and defines it. On a car or a truck, the gas tank is tucked away out of sight. But on a motorbike, there's no place to hide it. So you may as well just show it off. To make a custom gas tank, the metal worker starts with a sheet of sturdy cold rolled steel. He traces around paper patterns to transfer their outline to the steel. There are seven pattern pieces. The design is a tapered classic one. He follows the lines with an electric metal shear. With it, he can produce a rough cut quickly. He switches to a lever-operated shear to trim the parts cleanly and precisely. He physically bends one piece around a tube to create the tunnel, the lower section of the tank that fits around the backbone portion of the bike frame. He cuts the tunnel to size along marked lines. He drills holes in the tunnel for the mounting tubes. Using threaded bolts as guides now, he positions the two mounting tubes on the holes and welds them to the tunnel, creating leak-proof seams. With rods attached as a mock-up of the rest of the tank, he tests the fit to the bike. He confirms the handlebars move freely and that there's no interference with the engine. Next, he uses an English wheel on the top two panels. He rolls each panel between two wheels to take the profile from flat to curved. He tests the curvature against the mock-up rods. It needs tweaking. He continues to shape it until the custom gas tank part matches the mock-up perfectly. Using another machine now, he forms a stylish curl onto the edges. This will also allow the two parts to be joined neatly at the peak. After marking the location of the fuel cap, he punches small holes for mounting screws. He cuts out the hole for the gas cap. He joins the two top sections of the custom gas tank with tack welds. A more permanent weld will come later. He drills holes for mounting the top panel assembly to the tunnel, spacing them to correspond with the mounting tubes. With the mock-up rods removed from the tunnel, he joins the top panel assembly to it. He then tack welds the sides to this custom gas tank assembly. He hammers the tank's front cap against a form to give the outer edges a rounded profile. He sands the part around the edges to fine-tune the contours and ensure a perfect fit. He tack welds the front cap to the rest of the motorcycle tank. And with the tank structure complete, it's time to make it leak-proof. He does a full penetration weld on every seam. Using a pneumatic tool, he sands the seams smooth and flat. He then sands the rest of the tank by hand to make the entire surface uniform. He positions the tank on the bike. After equipping the gas cap with a gasket, he screws it tightly to the custom tank. Using mounting screws and wing nuts, he secures the tank to the bike frame. This custom gas tank now becomes a canvas. He paints it and applies silver borders and graphics requested by the customer. He connects the tank to the carburetor and this bike is ready to show off its new custom look.